I don't know if you guys have heard of this concept called girl dates, but when yeah. girls meet new girls and we want to go on a platonic like friend experience, we get dressed up and it's like you feel all nervous and giddy. You're like, Dee, like I'm going on a date, but it's like it's so cute. And like I don't think that that's a thing that guys do. I feel like you guys meet someone and you're like, I don't know, like we can fucking chill and then you hang out and then you're like i guess we're friends now and then you just do the thing and so there are like, like that <laughs> there are no nerves there's no, no but like we are setting you guys up on guy friend dates and you guys should be nervous because today mm -hmm. we are going to test your breaking points we are going to mm -hmm. show you guys what you would do in ridiculous situations and see if you guys would agree or do the same thing as your partner and that's mm -hmm basically gonna tell us are you meant to be fucking friends so be yeah. afraid we're we're all for efficiency we're for efficiency, we're for efficiency here we're we don't want you to meet each other and then i don't know not know if one of you is a murderer until mm. five years from now and you, then you have to, to deal people. with it down the road what happens to those five years now it's fucking wasted no no mm -mm. no ma'am no ma'am nope. we're gonna figure nope. it out today no waste of time. So pretty much the rules are really simple. Um, it's we're gonna see if your platonic future boyfriend is a match made in heaven. And here's how it'll work. So we'll present a question to one member of Team Coco and a member of Team Eric at the same time. Those two players will discuss and debate which makes most sense to each of them. And when both answers are locked in, We'll see if it was the same answer for your silent teammate. The silent teammate turned into us ahead of time before the game got started. And for every matching answer, oh, no. your team gets a point. And one step closer to the bromance of lifetime. Mm. <laughs> team Eric, the losing team, I give you permission um, to decide who goes first. Eric, would Fuck you? Fuck you. I, I don't want this. <laughs> this wasn't horrible. <laughs> this wasn't nice. OK, um, in that case, Team Eric will go first. Okay. We go. Um, well, we actually, go. actually, Team America and Team Coco are going first. I literally forgot the rules immediately. Okay. <laughs> well, but who wants Who wants to answer first? Let's start with Char two. Let's start with Charlie and Cronin. So Charlie and Cronin, you are the representatives for your teams. All right. Well, this, I got us. I got us. <laughs> these are question. This question was already presented to your teammates ahead of time and it is your job to try and pick which answers they picked. It so I'm, same, I'm, it I'm trying to figure ones. out what my team Coco yeah, teammate, mm -hmm. okay, What team okay. Coco would say. All right, yeah. I got him figured mm -hmm. out. We got, I got you, man, I can see And Charlie is trying to figure out Look what Bryce, what Bryce said. Yeah. The okay. Bryce in my eyes. <clears throat> so this first category is called life. Life, all right? You're living together deep down the line as real best bros do. Because you're boys, you're naturally going to be fucking disgusting. But which of the following disgusting things you both inevitably, not even a discussion, absolutely will do is just too far. A, leaving your shaved pubes in the shared sink. B, Fucking in the other's bed, making a mess and not changing the sheets. C, using the other's toothbrush twice a day, every day for a year. Or D, wearing the other's briefs and leaving skid marks. Which one do you think your partners chose? Or which ones do you think your partners chose? You can discuss this in, uh, between the two teams, by the way. You can try to sabotage, do whatever the fuck you need to do. I see. But so. Will and Bryce, you guys can't respond. Yeah, Will and Bryce, yeah, you're yeah. silent. <laughs> I think I got an answer. I think hmm, if I'm channeling the Bryce energy correctly, I'm thinking either a C or D situation. If I have to lean into it, I'm going to say C. Mm hmm. Jordan, yeah. do you have an okay. idea? Okay. Okay. Well, what I, I'm wondering what I need to talk to Charlie about because I got Will down. So am I am I supposed to get in his head and make him think he's going the wrong direction? <laughs> yes. All right, let's, let's hear it. Let's hear it. Mm -hmm. Okay. Well, Honestly, if you're I, if, super so confident. basically, I, I'm giving I'm giving ill-advised counsel to try to destroy him, if which you is want I, which is good. <laughs> okay, great. I'm going to tell you why you're wrong about Bryce. Um, yes, 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 yes. <laughs> you're thinking a C um, for Bryce, and this is a man who hikes. <laughs> once, as far as we know, is once. And so think of the circumstances he has to be in where he may have to use someone else's toothbrush. 
Is that gross to him? No, it's it's hygiene. It's survive. It's potentially survival. You know. Mm. <laughs> so is that something that'd be too far for him? I don't know. That's up to you to decide. I'm just saying, if that's your final answer, so be it. But just consider. <laughs> So be it. What is your answer going to be? The energy that I'm getting, though, the price that I'm getting is also woefully unprepared. So I feel like, oh, I, like, I just gotta go. I just gotta go. I just gotta get it done. So like, I feel like I got that one on. I feel like I got it on. So underwear, skid marks, skid marks, not a big deal. You know, like, throw them away, get some new one. Like, I feel like that's fine. But like, I feel like C is really the one that's gonna, that's gonna turn the table right there. Mm, mm, mm. Okay. Cronin, mm. what are you going with? Are you locking anything in? Well, I'm locked in on a C2 for Will, but I just had oh. to throw I just had to throw Charlie <laughs> off. <laughs> <laughs> I see. Okay, so we're both locked in for C. So, Team Eric's correct answer for this question was it was C. It was C. Woo! Bryce, absolutely. Yeah, go, using the other two first twice. Let's go here. Yeah, you know um, yeah. <laughs> and then the correct answer for Team Coco was also C. That oh, oh, great, Will. Congratulations. Go, team Coco. What? You just picked you one. Oh. It off. Good job. Look, my, Good job my, my time in, in college in the South has helped acclimate me to what is going to be good for good for Will. So I think, I think we're making progress. He's got it down. West, West Virginia's so, territory, So son. you like skin marks on your underwear. <laughs> got it. <laughs> got it. And got beds, understood. You're just sharing beds back and forth. As, so whatever. Oh. I bed, your bed. Me, casa, su casa, Fun. same thing. Did you Listen. Oh, gross. Time? That's nasty. All right. Coco? Licked. Eric. Ooh, Take us in. That's right. Okay, the first question that we have is for Charlie and for Cronin. And in these next categories, there's not going to be an, a, an option to steal. So you're going to have to get it right the fucking first time. That's why we've Don't turned fuck up the fucking I think, I think. Don't Don't fuck let me up. See you. Don't fuck up. So the question for Charlie and for Cronin is, <clears throat> you know, shit happens. Sometimes your best bro has an affair with your wife. Oops. Your bros, though, 99% of the time you can get past it. But what's the one thing that would be too much of a betrayal for your perfect bro tanglement to handle? Mm. A, they actually only fuck while scrolling through your Facebook profile from 2008. Laughing at your sad quotes gets them off. B, while they're hooking up, your best friend role plays as the one ex your wife has that makes you insecure. C. They only fuck in positions your wife has told your bro you aren't flexible enough, big enough, strong enough, genuinely adequate enough to pull off. Or D. <laughs> that last one gets me generally. Yeah, that's hit hard. <laughs> or D. They only fuck while you're all in the same room. You've never noticed. It's a game for them. You're simply a pawn in their sexual amusement. <laughs> Which one's too far? <laughs> Only one of them is, so... <laughs> Only one, the right I, I, I need to hear B one more time because things things clipped. Of course. B, yeah, while you're hooking up, your best friend role plays as that one ex your wife has that makes you insecure. Uh, hmm. Mm. Ding dong, ding dong, dong, ding dong, ding. What is it? Mm. Yeah, this one came in intense. It did. Welcome to part two. Yeah. I mean, That's even awesome. just just the, the phrasing of these questions raises the bar of someone's what they can take. So I really, yeah. I have to, yeah. you have to, I have to think about Will in extreme scenarios, which he was and in I one. I have to come in I here. mean, he was in a, a McDonald's in Iowa with a potential, you know, so. This seems like not an extreme scenario. For Will yeah, so all. clearly the, uh, right in being in the same room, being in the same room bathroom, being in the same room bedroom is not going to be an issue, you know, I feel like that's, you know, Gotta steer Cronin out of the. Gotta steer Cronin into a different answer. Obviously, Will's comfortable with being in the same room, being in the same bathroom. Let's see. Uh, where's Will gonna go? Where's Will not gonna go? You know? I don't know. It's true. Oh yeah, I know. But it's just, it's, it's, it's. I'm not sure if this is reverse psychology or double reverse psychology. <laughs> double reverse for sure. Yeah. Go to you, man. All right. Go to you, man. All right. Go. All right. Well, I, I, I'm gonna, I'm gonna not, I'm not gonna prolong this. I'm going with D. You're going with a, because, a, because I believe it, and also despite Charlie. <laughs> Charlie, <laughs> what are you going with? That is the slang right. that we like. Yes. There's the confidence, and but Bryce, I got you. We're going with C. We're going with C? 
Wait. All right. Is that before I before I lock that in? What was he again? <laughs> See? Yeah, like, I love this. Love this. They're splintering. They're splintering. <laughs> See? <laughs> they only yeah. fuck in positions your wife has told yeah, you, bro, yeah, yeah, that yeah. you aren't yeah, yeah, flexible yeah. enough. X Y Z. C. Locked in. C. Locked in. And locked in D. Okay. For Team Coco, the correct answer was D. They only oh, fuck in the same room. Team me. Team me. They only fuck oh, in the same room. Shit. And for Fucking Team Eric, for Team Eric, the correct answer was it was also D. They okay. Were all the same. Room. Oh my gosh, this is huge. I have this no is huge. problems with my dick size. I have no problems with how I give it to my girlfriends. That if you had the most no personal problem. answer, though. that was the most personal answer. I'm just saying. <laughs> oh man, wow. <laughs> no Charlie, I thought you knew me, sucks. man. <laughs> I'm about to have two new bros by the end of this, and Charlie's gonna be left alone. <laughs> <laughs> That's right, what I'm guys. waiting for. Wait, Charlie, this is the blood that blood shed right for you, Charlie. I don't really want to be your bro, but we can text and stuff if you want. To. <laughs> yeah. I love that, Will. I love that. I don't want you to be alone. Okay. You just will be. You know what I mean? It's different. <laughs> you see what you did there? Will. <laughs> okay, the last question in this category, guys. We're going to knock it out. We only we're have two to, questions left. We're going to Bryce okay. and Will for this one. <clears throat> All right, Charlie. All right, Charlie. You got this the hard shit, part guys. of this is remembering all the all the <laughs> <It> really <laughs> is all yeah, these okay. answers are like a paragraph each. Oh, it's so slow on this one. Okay, fuck the okay. bullshit. We all want to know the truth. Which one of these four things do you know are most likely to start an argument if your bro disagrees with you? We are starting a war. A. The fate of Donald Trump. B. The length of your dick. C. Who discovered your favorite mutual band first? And D, dogs or cats? Yeah. Oh no, I thought there would be a clear one. <laughs> no. 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 <laughs> Simply no. no. Dogs, cats, Trump is in there. Mm -hmm. Someone's beating his the length of your penis. You know, Cronin. Yeah. Cronin seems like he wants to have a big dick. <laughs> he wants to have a big dick. Um, I'm pissed at you for saying that, dude. <laughs> well, well, it's your partner, so you gotta figure out yeah, your answer. Yeah. I'm just trying to help you. Yeah. <laughs> I see what you're bros doing. Bro's helping bros. I see what you're doing. I see what you're doing. Uh, I don't remember all of them. <laughs> okay, I'm thinking. Will, are you uh, fucking okay? <laughs> Cronin, Am I okay? Cronin. I'm actually, I'm just thinking, all right, Cronin, look at me. Focus. The audience won't see this. Tell me to stop. Okay, dude? <laughs> <laughs> he's doing, he's measuring a dick, a dick with his hands. <laughs> I want you all to know. Go, go. Cronin, dude. Oh okay, uh... <laughs> Dogs or cats, baby. Dogs 60 or cats. seconds on the board. You're saying. You're, you're saying, saying dogs, dogs or, or cats? cats Bryce? No. <laughs> Which one are you saying, Bryce? <laughs> Bryce, lock in your answer. Um, okay, so in order A is the fate of Donald Trump. B is the length of your dick. C is who discovered your favorite mutual band first. And D is dogs or cats. I'm going to lock in with C. I, I feel like, you know, he's a, he's a music guy, so I feel like he would be. Oh, I don't know. I don't know. Dang it. Dang it. Dang it. 30, 30 seconds. seconds left. 30 seconds. Uh, I just want Will to go so he doesn't copy me again. <laughs> <laughs> All you need to think about is what flavor ramen you want, dude. Back off. <laughs> <laughs> Mushroom flavor. There we go. That dashi. But it's spicy. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'm between C and D. Just be ten seconds. Deeper. Ten seconds. Uh, five. five. I'm, I'm gonna. Uh, all right. I'm gonna say B because I didn't trust myself. I'm gonna say B. You're gonna say B. All right, Will. What are you're you saying? You're locked in, Will. I'm locked in. 
Time doesn't matter to Will. <laughs> yeah, what is time? The longest distance between the two places is time, my friend. Uh, we're gonna go with. Time. We're gonna go with C. I kind of want to go with D though, but I'm going okay. with C. C is right. locked in. I just feel like he's gonna have like an eloquent answer for this, and I can't think of an eloquent one for cats and dogs. All right, and Bryce. Okay, so Will, you're C. Bryce, you are B. All right. Team Eric, the final answer was, unfortunately, D. I have no problem with my dick size. <laughs> <laughs> and Team Coco, the final answer was, C. Oh, my God. Good job. Baby oh, boy. Good job, Team Coco. Are you kidding me? I have Good to job. tell you. I have to tell you, it is impossible to stay silent and not move any face muscles while they're deciding. I don't know. <laughs> really good. I, dude, I looked at you so hard. Oh, my God. Now. And you I try. You so hard. I, I, try, I try to take what you're looking at and give it back to you without doing anything. Why do I feel like this <laughs> romance is already you're established? You're like a mirror. I saw myself Charlie, in you. Charlie, Willing and Charlie are already established. <laughs> oh, okay, my heart guys. rate. My heart. These my last heart. two questions are gonna be for the gold, all right? We are going to pull out the worst case scenario. 60 seconds from the very beginning of the question, from the moment we give you the answers, you have 60 seconds to decide. And this first question is going to Bryce and Will. Bryce and Will, you are up. Okay, so, time to redeem yourself. Time to redeem yourself. <laughs> Sometimes, the worst case scenarios are the little things. The shit you didn't notice until five years in, but are just absolutely unacceptable. Which of these pet peeves would end even your strongest future brosage fest? A, they watch Emily in Paris, unironically. B. Hey, hey the show I'm doing is playing producers, okay? Back off. <laughs> B, B. Your bro has been watching you sleep, as in standing over your bed, staring at you sleep for years. C. They eat tubs of mayonnaise a day, straight out of the jar, as can only be explained by a deep, terrifying psychosis. And, and D. You realize after five years that they literally have never blinked. Not once. Just think about that for a second. Which one is it? 60 seconds starting now. Uh, repeat them real quick one more time. Yes, Emily in Paris, Emily and Paris, unironically, is A. B, your bro is watching you sleep. C, they eat tubs of mayonnaise. And D, they've never blinked. It could be Emily in Paris, you little stinker crown. <laughs> <laughs> I want to hit you for it, dude. I want to hit you for it. No watch it. I'm part of Jack's media right now, and I need you to back off. If that's what you're talking about. <laughs> 30, 30 seconds left. C and D's what? C and D's what? C and D's what? I got him confused in my head. C and D. C is tubs of mayonnaise. D is they've never blinked. I'm, I'm, I'm gonna lie. I'm you. gonna go with D. I mean, he wouldn't have eyes. I, I'd be confused. I think he'd be confused. I think. <laughs> okay. I hear a team Eric B, and I hear a team Coco D. Is that correct? Yes. Just yes. doesn't yes. seem right. Just doesn't seem right. Okay. <laughs> Just doesn't track. All right. The correct answer for team Coco. For team Coco, the correct answer was B, not oh. D. Your bros and watching you sleep. Look, Will, fucking you were years. right. You were right there. This, the time, the time. Uh, yeah. That was the last. That was my last choice. I was like, he can watch me. That's okay. He's <laughs> he can watch me sleep. <laughs> That's okay. He, he just walks with me. He talks with me, and so does Cronin. It's fine. And then for Team <laughs> Eric, for Team Eric, the correct answer was C, not D. Oh! It All right, was hey. tubs of mayonnaise. <laughs> tubs of mayonnaise. <laughs> We're still ahead. We're still ahead. We're no good. one We're gets golden. points that time. Okay. No one gets oh. points. And the last question. The last okay. question we are Charlie. handing over to Charlie and Cronin. Let's bring it in. Honesty is the best policy, but deep secrets are often exposed until later down the line. Which one of these secrets from your homie would most likely send you to the woods never to return again? <clears throat> a. Your bro accidentally murdered his baby brother when he was five, waited for his parents to go to sleep, then watched his baby bro in the crib until he smothered him to death with the nearest stuffed animal, but he swears he never thought about that murder again. 
<laughs> B. He's been using your social security number, credit card, and identity for your entire friendship and has literally destroyed your credit by buying really black market shockingly graphic porn. Everyone thinks you bought the porn because it's all in your name. C. He's currently holding a family of five hostage in your shared apart in your shared basement. You don't know why. You don't know who they are or what your bro wants from them, and he won't tell you. They've been down there for years. Finally, he's having an affair with your parents. That's right, both of them. He tells you he's not even in love with them. He's just using them for that hot, bod, three-way, middle-aged parent action, and is probably gonna break their hearts when he's bored. 60 seconds That's on the right. clock. Right. Which, which, which of these would send me to the woods? Which yeah, which is, is just too far. Which, which Only one, one of them is too far. Which one do you think would send Will? Will to the woods. <laughs> right, right, Only right. Only one's too far. Okay. <laughs> Only, <laughs> one. <laughs> Only one's too far. I would, I would do three of them. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> Rapid fire, Team Eric, D. Okay. D. I'm not, I'm, D. I'm, Locked in. I'm slowly... Use your 60 seconds, mm. and I believe in you. Uh, the amount of times I've heard that. <laughs> 30 seconds That's left. That's amazing. That's amazing. That's okay. the best thing I've ever heard. What would send Will into the woods? This is Blue Avatar. The Blue Avatar, not the other Avatar. Connect our hairs. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> There's a couple of them. Five seconds left. Five. Five that, seconds. I, I'm gonna argue on your concept of time, but uh, um, <laughs> I'm sorry. Thank I you, know you oh, Yes, yes, yes. Okay. Um, um, okay, fucking a... Uh, I think, I think, I think uh, the, the family. The family of five. The Holy family of five. Family of five hostage. Are you locked All in? Right. I'm locked in. All right. Courtney. Team Eric, you chose D, correct? Yes. Unfortunately, Ow. Rice picked C. Fuck. Yeah. Incorrect. The family. <laughs> holding Team the family Coco. hostage. Cronin, you pick C. The final answer was. No, I don't like your delivery. C! Oh! <laughs> <laughs> That's okay. Look at that. That's okay. I That's don't know okay. if I. I don't know if I've guessed wrong for Will yet. This is a match rating. You haven't guessed, dude. You see me. I would give you my uh, number through this, but I don't want the people to have it after okay. my like Mormon bathroom spiel. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Guys, no, I, um, I, I would I, be like, if only if episode. only we had time to to give all of the paragraphs of reasoning I have behind each of these answers. <laughs> yeah. we're, we're we'll do a talk back. We'll bring you yeah, back we'll on to talk about <laughs> talk about all of yeah. these. <laughs> All right. Um, guys, where, I would where, like to uh, where say are they this. now? <laughs> uh, literally, where are they? <laughs> where are they now? In a basement. Or five. Yeah. <laughs> First of, okay, so a couple of things. First of all, before I give the final score, I have to point out something that was shocking to us when we were receiving these questions. So, for specifically for Bryce and for Will, I want you to know that you answered identically every single time for your questions, which means wow. you actually are meant to be. And this, the, the, the final score is you should be best friends. It did not happen I even will. once for the other team, and you had it every single time you answered the exact same <laughs> question. Share that phone. What but, flavor oh, ramen? What flavor ramen? I need to know. <laughs> <laughs> but the final score for this, I would love to say that it was close, but it was not. It was um, not. The final was score not. was Team Coco for Team Eric One. Team Coco, you are the winners of the episode. Congratulations. And I that is totally what they call a we'll match get them next maker. time.